what's up YouTube um, I wanted to show you guys a little trick or secret hidden menu that all the Chevy trucks have that they don't automatically put on the main uh, info page so what you're gonna want to do is push the left button and this will bring you over to your info audio phone navigation you want to go to options and it's already on it so if it's on a different screen you're gonna to want to scroll to info pages you're gonna to want to push the right button and here you go instantly from the factory they don't turn on the trailer brake four-wheel drive vehicles or trucks they don't turn on the off-road and this feature is actually really cool so we're gonna to want to turn that on there's a blank page so if you don't want any any info up you can check that your speed limit which there's two on there's two speed limit pages on this truck so that one was is just what the speed limit is I don't know if it's we'll see it has a timer and then let's see they're all checked and then yes yeah, so there's speed and then speed limit so I have them all checked now fuel range everything oil life tire pressure so if, this is kind of how you customize your info page so if you don't want to see engine hours we could turn engine hours off um, trans fluid temps a really good one to have on um, and then this off-road one is like really cool if you like to do some four-wheel drive in or anytime you're on like a incline or something <clears throat> I'll show you that in a minute so all right so let's get back out I'm gonna want to go left so go left again and then back up to info and then boom so now we have all our info pages that we just clicked on so oil life tire pressures my fuel economy which is crap you're right now I've been idling for a minute trying to jump start some Ford um, timer never really use the timer I guess it'd be cool if uh, if uh, you were on a trip or something and you wanted to time how long it took you to to get there or without just guessing by looking at the clock so I'll stop that you can reset it um, here's the speed limit one which I don't leave on it literally just tells you what the speed limit is based off your navigation so here's my trans fluid temp this is a really good one to have trailer gain um, if you have a trailer package you can use this will, one will come up you can set your gain and you can and it's over here on the left so um, if your truck doesn't have a factory trailer brake then I'm not sure if this comes up it might still come up but I really doubt it <clears throat> I know that there's a connector behind that bezel that you can add a trailer brake the factory trailer brake but only on certain RPOs and then now here's the off-road this thing's really cool so it tells you if you're in two-wheel drive um, it tells you the incline you're on so if you look real close um, I'm in my driveway and my driveway is two degrees which is super cool so you can watch this while you're driving down a hill see different grade see what grade the highway is it's pretty cool I actually had this off but I'll probably just leave it on um, and let's go back up yeah so this this is the secret hidden menu. It's pretty funny how they, they keep those things turned off. And you would never know they're there unless you went all the way in. All right, here's another set of things we're going to look at. So we're going to want to push the home button. Um, you're going to want to come over. Uh, actually, no, it's right here. Sorry. Settings. Um, now, this is, this is what's cool. So you're going to want to go into vehicle. Um, this this is how you set everything so you can set auto fan speed auto and mine's on medium so this is where it, it automatically turns it on when you remote start your truck I believe then you're gonna wanna let's go to power door locks auto door lock or delayed door lock 
mine's off auto door lock is all doors so when i put the truck in drive and drive off it will auto lock the doors so here is another really cool this is where you find your fob settings so I think it's down here this is yeah right here remote window operation this is this is what you want to want to turn on so when you unlock your truck with your key fob and then you hold the unlock button on the key fob and keep holding it it'll roll all your windows down simultaneously it's really cool so yeah, it's a really hot summer day and you want to cool the truck down fast do that with the remote start your truck's blowing AC full blast and has the windows down and gets all that hot air out of there as you're walking up to the vehicle. So you're gonna to wanna to turn that on and you're gonna to wanna to try that out, it's super cool. Um, remote start, heated seats. I have that on during this winter, so it's really cool. So when you remote start your truck, it turns your heated seats on and it it's really nice so in the winter you jump in your seats are nice and warm like I said this is gonna have all your remote stuff so it, I like to do lights and horns because when you lock the truck and you click lock twice it's gonna honk the horn now here's a really cool trick if the truck doesn't honk when you lock it it means one of your doors is still open I use this feature all the time because I have three kids and they're notorious for leaving my doors open. So I'll go to the grocery store and as I'm walking away, I'll try to honk my truck. And if it doesn't honk, I instantly know one of the kids did not shut the door. So I go, who did it? And then they run back, shut the door, double lock on the fob and your truck will honk. It ensures that all your doors are shut. Um, yeah, just play around with these settings. It's really cool. Um, remote door unlock so like your first unlock it'll only do your driver's door which is nice because if you're in a sketchy neighborhood you only want to unlock your door jump in real quick and your other doors are still locked so that's cool you got comfort and convenience you can change the chime volume this this really had controls all of the body stuff and you're going to want to go through and set this up to the way you like so all right, guys, thanks for watching. Um, check my uh, page out, subscribe, hit that like button. It really helps out the YouTube algorithm. I really appreciate it. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching.